The southwest coast of Taiwan is a mangrove reserve, where it is also a major winter habitat for the endangered bird, the black-faced spoonbill. Carrying out a large-scale construction project requires additional considerations to accommodate environmental and ecological impact to those sensitive regions. Director General of Highways joined forces with Sinotech Engineering Consulting Company, led the way and engaged Taiwan's first carbon management project, the West Coast Expressway, Dadong Liao to Jiu Kuai Swap section. Holistic strategies of environmental mitigation and low carbon design were employed throughout the project. In addition, training sessions and regular on-site consultants were also provided for contractors, subcontractors and material suppliers in order to conduct a carbon inventory for local construction and building materials. Detailed unit emissions of each elevated highway, including pile, foundation, pier and superstructure, were analyzed and capable of serving as great references for future projects. As a result, the carbon emission of the project reduced 22% of concrete by substituting cement with fly ash and ground granulated blast furnace slag, 88% of retaining wall by constructing the reinforced earth wall, and 50% of pavement by utilizing porous asphalt concrete pavement. The outcome of the project achieved the first construction project, acquired ISO TS-14067 and passed 2050 certification, established CFP-PCR of roadways and bridges, and provided domestic carbon emission factors of construction materials for national database for Taiwan. In summary, the West Coast Expressway Badong Liao to Jiu Kuai Swal project not only preserved environmental sensitive area with multiple environment mitigation strategies, but also engaged the very first carbon management system for in roadways and bridges in Taiwan.